Miami quarterback Kevin Olsen has reportedly been suspended for the season opener, leaving Coach Al Golden with one less option against Louisville in their opener September the 1st. Ray Crawford here with managing editor Pete Futek, and according to reports out of Miami, allegedly it was Olsen who failed a drug test leading to this yet to be announced suspension. So few you take Ryan Williams, who's injured, add Olsen, cross him off the list. It leaves transfer Jake Heaps as the likely guy. Do you trust him to beat the Cardinals? No, not at football. Here's the problem. He's just not that good. He couldn't get it done at BYU, couldn't get it done at Kansas. Look, he was a big-time talent coming out of high school. He's got an accurate arm. He's smart. He's got a lot of the intangibles. He's just not that good at reading defenses, and he just doesn't have that big enough arm. I don't think you rely on him, but look, if he's your starter for this week one, you hope he can get him through this. Just manage the game. Don't screw up. Don't make mistakes. Get through this game. Williams is trying to get healthy. He hopes to return perhaps as soon as October. Yeah. You get Olsen back in the mix with heaps. We're looking at likely three different starting quarterbacks at here least. by October. How are they going to find wins this year? you got to hope that you just get through this and not rely on your quarterback. It's not quarterback you anymore. You just Vinny Testaverde, Steve Walsh, you name the great quarterbacks throughout the years. They just don't have that right now. You can't rely on Ryan Williams to come back. That torn ACL still needs time. you got to go with Duke Johnson. you just got to pound that running game, keep giving the ball. Heck, use him in Wildcat every once in a while if you have to. The defense, though, has got to be far better than it was last season. The D's going to have to come up with more big plays. Special teams going to have to work. Everything else is going to have to be in place. You don't have to rely on the quarterback. But Duke Johnson, Duke Johnson, Duke Johnson, and hope he can hold up. We'll make for an interesting fall camp, that's for sure. A few thanks very much for all things college football. Keep it here to CampusInsiders.com.